Hello there, this is Jay from JCAD. I make AutoCAD tutorials for students and professionals in the fields of architecture and interior design. If you are new to our channel, subscribe to get our weekly tutorials on AutoCAD and other design software. In this video, I will show you how to measure the area in AutoCAD or figure it out. There are several ways to measure area in AutoCAD. The easiest way is by going to the home ribbon and then the utilities section and then the measure tool if you click on the expanded list here, you will see there's area, and then you can choose this. And let's say I wanna measure, for example, this structure right here. I'm gonna click on this point, this point, this point, and this point. And then what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna click enter to finish measuring or finish defining the area to measure. And now we get this, we are seeing area as giving us this figure. Uh, basically, this is how many square inches, and if you want to see the square foot, it's the number right after it, or the value right after it. And it's also giving us the perimeter. I didn't know it does that, but this is cool to know, so now you know. The area, the area, the measure area tool from here will allow you to get in square inches, square feet, and you will get the perimeter as a bonus. Alright, so this is one way to do it. There's also another way is by selecting a closed polyline for example you can get the area and I will show you this uh, but first you need to have the properties menu open and you can open the properties menu by going to the view ribbon and then choosing properties from here and you can also type properties on your on your keyboard and click enter and that will open it as well All right and I'm just gonna move this a little bit to this side so when I select a closed polyline let's say I wanna figure out the area of this residence right here. I'm just gonna click on the polyline that defines the perimeter of it. And I drew it uh, using a polyline on purpose because the polyline will give me the area under the properties menu. If I go down here under geometry, you will see we get the area and I'm gonna expand this so we can see the values. And here we go, we get it in square inches and we also get the value in square feet. And you can see here, we roughly have 1014 square feet essentially right and we also get the length or the perimeter of this as well which can be very informative as well one more one more way to do this uh, it's not a different way it's actually using a different element than the polyline i'm just going to click escape here twice to deselect and then if you select a hatch element i'm going to click on this hatch that represent the roof on the top and then the same if you go down here on in the hatch on the properties menu under geometry, you will also get the area. I didn't know there's cumulative area. I'm not sure the difference here. Uh, we're getting area and then we're getting cumulative area. I'm not sure the difference between both, but in this case, it's identical. All right, so this is one more way to figure out or measure the area in AutoCAD. And that was it.